my name's Tom Ingram. I'm the driver of the number 80 Speedworks Motorsport Toyota Aventis. We're down here at Toyota Manufacturing UK. We've been down here for the last two days, filming around the factory and filming around the awesome facility that we have here. What's really cool about the Speedworks Aventis that we race in the British Touring Car Championship is it's all built here in Britain. On. There was a couple of things that we had to do before they let me loose on the test track and I actually had to take a driving test to be able to drive my own car around the track which was quite interesting. Big differences from the two cars that even I just drove on the test track. We had my race car, the Toyota Aventis race car and then I was out in one of the Toyota Aventis road cars as well. Two very different experiences and obviously with the race car a lot of noise, a lot of power, to then jump back into the road car as well or vice versa and feel the differences it makes. Obviously from an engineering point of view, it's not many carryover bits at all, it's completely different. The noises, sounds, smells and, and just a, a very, very starting point of the big changes you see. There's a few parts that the, the two cars do in fact share and the Shell is still a Toyota Aventis road car that was built here in fact. The doors are the same, bonnets the same, mirrors are the same, so there's still quite a few common parts that we use. The driving test was interesting to see the safety side of things that go on and really analysing how the cars get tested before they go out on the public roads. Obviously I'm used to driving around UK circuits that are really you know, quite flat and there's no banking involved at all. Searching for an apex there, you see. <laughs> So to all of a sudden get let loose on the test track with really steep banking felt really bizarre. Congratulations, you've, uh, you've passed. Perfect. Yes. <laughs> <laughs>As you can see behind me, we've got the uh, the Belgian road that we had to drive along, and driving the touring car on this was really weird. Obviously, so bumpy and uh, and horrible to drive on. And we went right out to one of the big car parks where all the cars are held before they're taken off to their various destinations. And really weird to be driving through thousands and thousands of cars and seeing our little race car go go following through was quite uh, was quite funny.